Assalamu alaikum everyone Abdul is here and today I am going to talk about the footnote uh, when you read some type of document which, which is well written document or some thesis you could see such type of writing here and uh, uh, these are usually called the footnote or the end note of the page and uh, for example this is two and this is the two is mentioned here with sub case okay so this is a very beautiful way of writing instead of giving a reference here and someone uh, go to the end of the thesis after a two or three hundred pages and check it or in the books books maybe a, a 500 pages or 600 pages and then check the reference at the end uh, uh, instead of all these things instead of doing all these boring things this is a very good way to use the footnote to use the add note because uh, this make your document beautiful this make your document easy to read and easy to understand so uh, uh, let's learn how to use this in latex and I'm using overleaf for uh, latex because I think this is a better one and this is also online your data remain safe on the cloud and there is no need to download different type of classes and packages etc you just mention them and it is automatically uh, run on the system so for example uh, uh, I have written something here and I want to uh, mention a footnote here so simply you have to use the foot note okay and in the footnote you have to write uh, the uh, what do you want to write here which should be displayed at the bottom if the footnote for example SLE means that it is a service level agreement okay I just compile it to check is it working or not sorry I was on the wrong page uh, I was uh, on the third chapter and I here I was working on the second but, uh, now you can see that uh, uh, here service level agreement and it is written as a one to make it little bit dominant you can put numbering here for example I'm going to write one here that uh, it will be shown just like uh, a footnote one with service level agreement let's check it <coughs> yes one service level uh, agreement so if you want to make your documents beautiful and uh, easy to read you should use this footnotes in your books and uh, uh, and your different uh, type of documents and thesis especially thank you so much for watching